Roland Garros is officially underway. As the second slam of the season kicks off, we're running through every big storyline from the Parisian clay. The break starts right now. Hey everybody, I'm Andrew Guy. You're watching The Break. Main draw action from Roland Garros has begun and we've got two weeks of high quality tennis to look forward to. Here's everything you need to know before tuning into all the live action. Rafael Nadal is making what is likely to be his final appearance at Roland Garros. The 14-time champion didn't play in 2023 after a hip injury sidelined him for a year. With eight clay matches under his belt in 2024, Rafa will try to summon that vintage form to make a deep run at his favorite slam. He's set to face fourth seed Alexander Zverev in his opening round match on Monday. Nadal leads their head-to-head 7-3. Yannick Sinner could overtake Novak Djokovic as the new world number one after Roland Garros. Novak would have to reach the final in Paris in order to hang on to the top spot. If Yannick passes Novak, he'd be the 29th man to top the world rankings and the very first from Italy. Dominic Team and Diego Schwartzman bid farewell to Roland Garros for the last time as they both lost in the qualifying rounds. Two-time finalist Dominic Team announced 2024 would be his final season following ongoing wrist injuries. 2020 semifinalist Schwartzman shared that his final tournament as a pro would be at the Argentina Open in February 2025. The qualifying round saw American Katie Volinets, Brazil's Thiago Montero, and tour veteran Mikhail Kukushkin among the players who earned spots in the main draw. And keep an eye on the wildcard entries as well. Notable wildcard recipients include Ayla Tomjanovic, Sasha Vickery, Christina Mladenovic, Richard Gasquet, American Nicolas Moreno de Alboran, and Alize Cornet. Roland Garros marks Cornet's final pro event and 69th consecutive major main draw appearance. She'll face Kin Wen Zhang in the opening round. Some notable names who won't appear in the main draw include 2023 finalist Carolina Muhova, Jessica Pagula, Emma Raducanu, Caroline Wozniacki, Simona Halep, and Yuri Lehechka. That list might grow as a few top players are coming into Roland Garros with lingering injuries. Carlos Alcaraz and Yannick Sinner had to pull out of Rome with arm and hip injuries, respectively. Elena Rabakina is also a question mark as she too missed the Italian Open, citing illness. Now we're still a long way out, but it's never too early to mark your calendars for championship weekend. The women's final is scheduled for Saturday, June 8th, not before 9 a.m. Eastern time, while the men's final is scheduled for Sunday, June 9th, also not before 9 a.m. Eastern time. The champions will earn $2.6 million in prize money and 2,000 ranking points. But for now though, just enjoy those early round matches. Live coverage from Roland Garros begins daily at 6 a.m. Eastern time. We'll see you tomorrow.